Hey everybody, Natalie Barton here, dental hygienist. Welcome back to the channel. Let's talk about temping and what equipment I take these days. So a couple years ago, I made a video on all the different items I take with me temping. And you know what? A lot has changed since then. I've gotten more efficient. Dentists are actually doing a better job with having stuff that you need. So let's go over what I actually take with me now. It's pretty simple. For starters, I always take my own loops. You never know what office you're gonna walk into, and you know what, having your own loops is just something that everyone should have, honestly. I need a pair of ergo loops. I don't know if you guys have tried those yet, but I see the people wearing them, and their posture is phenomenal. And I'm like, you know what, I really need to invest in those. As Soon as these suckers break, that's what I'm getting. But what I have is, I have the designs for vision, love these and always have a light on them because I've walked into offices and they don't have a light on the chair which just blows my mind but that is becoming more of a thing they're not investing in those because they have lights on their loops so get light get a light on your loops and have multiple batteries I have two batteries with me I take every single day typically I don't run out of one battery but it has happened so I always have a spare with me just in case the other thing I always take with me that sits in my little case here is a name tag because you're the temp nobody knows your name the patients don't know your name the doctor doesn't know your name I answer to everything from Stephanie to Nicole to Valerie but it's nice to have your own name tag. So have a name tag made. It's really easy. I just do the little magnetic ones so it doesn't hurt my scrubs and they're pretty easy to do. Next thing you want is a timesheet. So this is something that, again, I temp a lot with cloud. So these are my timesheets and I always keep one. I keep them actually in my glove compartment, but I always have one in my case. It's just nice to have. One of the other things I keep in my loops case is my basic life support CPR card, just so I always have it and I know where it's at. You can keep it in your wallet, but I've got so much stuff in my wallet, so I try and keep the stuff that's like dental hygiene related all together. Just makes life easier. I always take lab jacket. I have freakishly long arms and broad shoulders, and it doesn't matter where I go, I tend to find they don't have jackets that fit me. So I just started buying my own and I have about three or four of them. That way I can wear them every day in the week. I usually work three to four days a week now. And uh, yeah, that way I'm set. And I go with black because I found most offices do black. So most of my scrubs are black. Most of my jackets are, well, all of my jackets are black. And uh, yeah, I just, I blend right in with everybody else. And I get the question of how long have you been here? Oh, about five minutes now and the patients freak out, which is super fun. But just have your own jackets. It's so much easier. Sometimes they'll have jackets for you and that's awesome when they have the little office logo or whatever. That's cool, helps you blend in a little better. But it's just nice to have your own jacket to kind of cover up during all the yuck we create every day. All right, last three things I take with me. I got a purse, I got a water bottle, and honestly, I take a snack sometimes. I usually don't take lunch with me, but that's my own personal thing with my doctor and that's weird, but anyway. Um, so you'd want a lunch, you'd want a water bottle, get a good water bottle, obviously your purse or bag of some sort, and then scrubs or clothes to change into. So I usually have a plastic bag or something I can throw my scrubs into when I leave the office, that way I'm not taking the dirties home on the car seat with me. So that's pretty much it. Um, yep, no, it's pretty easy to walk out the door in the morning. So it just makes life a lot easier than taking around your Cavitron or extra instruments or I do carry masks. I do carry level three masks in my car, I guess. That is one thing I still do. Um, and some of that is just from COVID because there were places that were insisting on the N95s, which I was not able to wear. So I took level threes with me because then they'd be like, well, all we have is level ones and I'm not doing that. So I do have some of those in my car, which I do occasionally use, but really, really rarely. Um, that's about it. 
everybody else tends to have all the gloves and people are so used to having temps at this point, which is kind of awful, but they are that they've really upped their equipment and they've upped um, just kind of the way they do things. And it's very nice. Um, as far as like computer programs and being ready for that kind of stuff, we'll do that in another video about how to be an awesome temp and kind of my updated thoughts on how to be a really good temp because I'm seeing a lot of bad temps out there and we can do better. I'm getting a lot of complaints from offices, so let's not do that. Anyway, different video. So anyway, like and subscribe. Have a great week. I will see you next week. Take care. Keep flossing.